Welcome to the channel. We have another exclusive look at two crass record reissues. As you know, the Crass Records label uh, in the uh, 80s released fantastic seven inch singles and uh, they've been reissued um, by One Little Independent. And these two are Sleeping Dogs, Beware and Lack of Knowledge, Grey. So I'm gonna show you what you get. Now, this particular one, there we go. This was one single that I didn't actually get back in the day. Uh, as you know, with all Crass Records, it comes with a poster. Let me see if I can just as well, be. Oh, goodness me. Uh, I'm not sure you'd want that put up in your house. But anyway, that's the poster. And for all you vinyl heads. So lack of knowledge, grey, A-side, we're looking for people, another sunset. Girl in a Mask, Radioactive Man, recorded in uh, 6th and 7th of August, Southern Studios, engineered by John Loder, produced by Penny Rimbaud, cover design by Lack of Knowledge and Dada Nana. Okay, so let's have a look at the record, vinyl, okay. Crass Records, as it was in the beginning, it's back. Look at that, brand new. Let's see what it says there, that's the category number. And then there's... Turn it round. Lack of knowledge, grey. Alex G. Abbey Road. That's what it says there. Okay. Let's give you a bit more detail about lack of knowledge. So lack of knowledge, they were an English post-punk band formed in 1978, but the lineup settled in 1980. LOK recorded the first single and within six months taking it seriously, they've recorded one seven inch single two seven inch EPs, a 12 inch single, two albums, and a retrospective CD. Um, now I think, I think from, from knowledge, this was not your standard crass punk uh, music, a bit like the Captain Sensible one that I featured before. And let's look at the second one. Let's put that back. The second one is called Sleeping Dogs Beware. Fantastic artwork. Okay, and once again, it's one little independent. Okay, let's see if we can open up the uh, open up the sleeve. Okay, so this looks American, doesn't it? Cleaning up America's backyard. Let's see what the posters like inside. The vast continents. Seemed a wild Eden to be mastered. That's weird, isn't it? Okay. Okay. And let's give you, oh, let's give you a view of the vinyl. So this side is same old story, concrete, and the other side is Susie's song, I Got My Tan, else in El Salvador and Soldier. And there's the thing, what does it say here? Attack of the Sleeping Dogs, it says there. That would look great, wouldn't it, spinning around? Okay, let's give you a bit more detail about the band. Okay, from my little, little notes. So, uh, Sleeping Dog were a San Francisco trio, bassist singer Bad Boy, Dion King, drummer singer Dirty Dog, David King, and guitarist Helen Harmon with rhythm section helped by Crassies, Penny Rimbaud and Feel Free. Sleeping Dogs came from the weird, artsy subset of local punk. Um, now, I will put links in the description so you can uh, check them out online and order them. Um, now, about the channel. Uh, Skies, if you haven't checked me out before, I produce videos pretty much every week uh, covering everything from uh, youth self, uh, youth culture, so I've got a lot of crass stuff. <laughs> I'm just a six foot one bloke who wants a pint. Shout down the microphone. <laughs> I've got a lot of stuff about mod. Yeah, this this is the Princess of Wales in Maybe, which is you know 
the nearest pub to me in Paul's house. But this is this is where it all happened. This is where we this is where we met every night. This is where we met our friends from Shearwater to go to the Roxy or the Marquee. Uh, or this is where we just analysed the gigs. This is where we plotted world domination for the jam. And happy to say it really worked out. It it worked out a treat, as they say. This is the first time I ever met Paul, probably summer of 76. Walked into this pub, introduced myself, said to Paul, you're my new neighbour. And uh, within seconds we hit it off. Um, and you know, started talking about music, football, beer, girls, the Sex Pistols, punk rock, and never looked back. That was it, started a journey, and on it went. The summer of 1976, um, as I say, we started seeing the Sex Pistols, 100 Club and The Clash, same bill, 50p, 1976. And then things happened really quickly. I think, the, what did the jam get signed? Probably March 1977, something like that. And, um, and that, that was it, the roller coaster started. Uh, if you check out uh, my latest uh, episode, or one of my latest episodes, it's a look back at 2022, and uh, it will give you a real flavor of what I do. And that's kind of, that's, that's the people that I want, that I hope my audience are, the people that have an attention span that's longer than two minutes. If you like what you see, do what's right. Subscribe. Subscribe to the Sky as YouTube channel. Where's the fine? Where's the thing? Oh, here we go. If you like what you see, please subscribe to the channel. It's really appreciated. Share it with your friends. Smash that like button. Smash that notification bell. Just smash everything. All right, there we go. So, this was Sleeping Dogs Beware and Lack of Knowledge Grey. Um, if you're interested in the craft stuff, uh, I have done episodes looking at the reissue of the Captain Sensible um, track, uh, the Omega Tribe one, or Omega as I kept incorrectly calling it, um, and also Honey Bane. Pay no more than 65p, no more. Okay, here we are. This is the single, You Can Be You, the tracks are Girl on the Run, Porno grows and boring conversations. Okay. Uh, but they're nice, I think they're cool. Um, it's great to have them again. I used to have, when I was a kid, every single uh, Crash 7 inch, with the exception, I think, of that one. Um, and. Uh, yeah, check them out. Thanks for watching and uh, enjoy the rest of your week.